Hey guys, I want to give you one simple trick. One simple thing that you can do, and I would make it a real like uh, priority as we go into the new year. So it can in tr increase trust, leads, and sales. And you all have to do it one time. So I'm working with a client a few months ago, and they said, Wayne, we're doing great until people get to like our sales call. And they hear our sales pitch, they like what we have, but we have no social proof. We have no social proof. They're not following us on any of the social media. So what they're doing is they're Googling us. And what they're finding is just our website, but nothing else, nothing else. Should I spend money and like get press releases done? And I'm like, yeah, sure, all that'll work. But why don't we get something out there that's going to get people to recognize you as the leader, to build that trust, to begin that indoctrination period, but also something that Google is going to recognize as a true worthy seo worthy piece of content so they place it on the first and second page so what i told them to do is something really simple i'm not going to do a long drawn out process maybe you've already done some of this maybe you haven't but this is something definitely bit into your wheelhouse and that is how to get on a couple maybe five six ten podcasts and you don't have to do it every day um, but get on five or six maybe ten podcasts in the next 60 days what that will do for you is, number one, gives you an opportunity to talk about your product, your service, your opportunity. If you target properly, and I'll show you how to do that in a moment, you're getting free audience. So get, imagine getting on 10 podcasts. Some of them may have 100 downloads. Some of them may have 10,000 downloads. But all of these people are hearing your message. And because they're listening to that podcast, if it's targeted properly, these are ideal candidates for you. So you can definitely pick up leads from this. You can definitely pick up sales couple things make sure you have a great way for them to contact you not hey just find me so make sure you have a a lead magnet set up to a page a lead page where people can find out more about you or a url directed to if you're trying to get them to find you on linkedin etc so make sure that's done then just get on there and share your knowledge it's actually really fun doing podcasts but how do you find the podcast to get on now there's a number of different services i'm affiliated with none of them at all I'm going to share with you one that I used in the past and it's that hopefully you can use as well. And again, I'm not affiliated with them, no affiliate commission. And, but it's a good way to get on six, eight, 10. My client got on six podcasts. They did pick up some sales at like 5k a piece. So they probably made, you know, two, you know, I think it was two or three sales. So they made 10, $15,000 from this. But more importantly, people can now find them when they Google them. They found the best two of those podcasts and they bit them in their automated, uh, the automated email sequence. So that's like people are going to hear about them and it's going to build credibility. So let me really quick just jump in and show you how to do this. Number one, I'm going to share my screen. And uh, do, 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 here we go. This is a uh, one of the sites. Now there's Podbooker, Podmat, just probably other ones. This is just one I've used in the past. So the importance behind this, let me log in. And I don't, I'm not currently using this. So I just want to show you, you know, if it shows, I'll show you what I've done in the past. But this is really good because you can look at podcast and this is just like no category chosen. You can go through which of these really would you like to possibly be on? Which one, like the natural healing reel, um, winning at work, health drips. So your health and fitness coach, like what are you trying to, who are you trying to reach? You can also go up here to categories and choose. Now what I've found is some people mark themselves on categories they're not even in. So just understand that. But if we go into business, let's take out health and fitness, business, entrepreneurship, self-improvement and marketing and we apply look at what we come up with so marketing geeks long story short and what i really like about this this is the leadership one so leadership powered by common sense it'll show you they have nine episodes okay you can go and you can listen to part of the episodes let's continue let's go a little deeper let's talk human behavior love that and i love the name of it and we pick another one. Let's pick one more. I just like this marketing geeks. So 133 episodes. Now, does that guarantee that they have a lot of listeners? No, and there's definitely, there are websites that you can go and you can see how many downloads they get and all that fun stuff. All I want to do is find one that's legitimate. They've done 133. I can jump up here and listen to it. So just Aaron. Okay, so I can literally say, hey, really enjoyed your podcast on this. Really enjoyed this. Now, how do let's say I want to pitch this person. 
I'd love to be on their show because if I'm on their show, I may get leads. I will definitely build trust with their listeners and mine, and I'll build SEO trust. So I'm going to pitch host. Uh, maybe I need to sign up later. Okay. Then here is where I can put in my message. So I just type in my message and then I can send the request. Now, because again, I'm not doing this currently, uh, I will show you some that I have applied for and got in. So here's one DIY for business. And so basically, if I can make this any larger, sure. So I just copied this over. Hi, my name is Wayne with my company, and I help professionals do this. Are you with me? My topic for September is, I gave the topic, how to influence others by influencing yourself first. And I gave um, four or five bullet points. Then I will provide your audience with tactical, practical strategies with zero pitching. Do you have room for me in September? So I would really do this at the end, like we're going into December. I would do this for January. Do you have room for me in January? My top, And what really makes this work is when you say my topic for January is, do you have room for me in January? It shows that you are actually not just spamming. You're actually reaching people with a topic that you want to get out there. Very powerful. Now, also, this one said, hey, thanks for your request. This seems like a great fit. And then I was able to go up here to view scheduling. See, I can view the profile or I can view scheduling. Hey, yeah, this sounds good. You sound like a great fit. Let's talk. If some, let me say, let me go back. Some are going to say, da, 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 da. oh, there's several that said it looks like a great fit. Here's one. Thank you for your request. At this time, it's not a great fit, but good luck in your search. That's okay. At least, I know they're not for me now. Now, here's the beautiful part. So, again, not affiliated. Okay. But you can upgrade. So, um, for like 200 bucks a year. Here's one. 300 a year. Let me blow this up for you. 300 a year. Or if you do monthly. And this is what I recommend my client to do. I said, jump in one month. Jump in there and get 30 pitches. Send out the 30 pitches. They got on... X amount, you know, it's just under 10 podcasts. That's all they needed. They didn't continue with it. So, but again, it built out what they needed. So they, again, that's Podbooker. There's Podmatch. There's a lot of them. This is just one I think is really simple. And I've used several times uh, and to get on, to not, number one, to find guests for my podcast when I was doing a podcast, but also to get on there. So this is one way to increase trust, leads, and sales. Why this is important, especially if you're doing, uh, Let's go back to this once. How many how many different podcasts are there? There's so many. It's on and on and on and on. Each one of these, I want you to remember this. Each one of these podcasts has their own audience of people that are already listening to them. And again, this is why I like to go in and see how many episodes. 453 episodes. Conversations that transform. Life transformation video. If I had any kind of personal development, self-help, I would be on this podcast. Does that make sense? Okay. If they say, no, this doesn't seem like a great fit for January, I'd come up in February. I would get on this podcast because they have a lot of podcasts. They have a lot of people that are listening to it. Again, no, not know how many people are going to buy, but they've done a lot of episodes. So it shows their consistency, and they wouldn't be doing 453 if they didn't have some people download it. So, that's one way you can increase trust, increase leads and on sales doing it once. Now, if you want to start a podcast, that's another thing. I'm not here for that. I just want to help you build a value add. So when somebody back to my client, hey, we are doing our Google research. We're researching you, which means they Googled you. And we're not seeing much about your company. Now they're going to see this person talked about you, this person talked about you, this person talked about you. And then I would take that link. So we'll go in one level deeper. Take that link if you were on uh, Live Life Transformation Radio, and I would share that link, of course, share it on all your social media. I'd also, if I'm going to do a press release, use a press release service, then I would make sure one of those links are in there. Maybe even do a press release service for each of the five or six podcast shows you're on. So it gives now Google the press release and that as backlinks. So anyway, hope this helps. 
If you need sales training for yourself or your team, you need appointment setters to get in there and book your calendar, or you need sales training for your closers. Maybe you need some closers to help reach your goals. Then you know what to do. Just you know, send me a message here on LinkedIn. I do appreciate you all jumping on here. Be sure to follow us if you're grabbing. If you have this newsletter and you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe. And uh, I look forward to connecting with you again. Get the podcast out. Let me know how it's working for you. If you have any questions on how to set it up, I'll be happy to help you. Have a good day.